way you think about credibility is, is critical. And a lot of lawyers come to the discovery process and in depositions, they put their cards on the table, they use all their documents. And I, I think a more successful approach when you're really going to trial is holding your cards back a little bit and setting up witnesses uh, so that at trial, you can undermine their testimony in a way they don't see coming. And I think that trying case is always going to have an element of being on your feet and reacting quickly and, and being an outstanding trial lawyer. But the type of work I do, I think I pride myself and we as a firm pride ourselves on, on knowing the underlying facts, the underlying science, the, the issues uh, that are going to be important at trial as well as anybody in the room. We go a little bit further uh, and we dig in a little bit more so that we can react quickly at trial to changing circumstances or unexpected developments because we just know the matter uh, as well as can be known. Uh, I secured a defense verdict uh, for United Airlines at a bench trial uh, in Chicago. Uh, the case was worth a little bit over $150 million where our house, which was essentially an internet version of Home Depot, uh, had brought an acquisition idea to United and believed it had been cut out of the deal. At the end of the day, our house didn't have the financial fortitude to participate. And there were several years of discovery of complex financial damages, other issues, where we got to trial and had a two-week bench trial, but essentially it was a he said, she said issue. Uh, United's image and brand was, was at stake in the marketplace and not unlike uh, much of what I do, I do a lot of product liability and mass tort work and, and in those cases when a company's product is at issue and you have hundreds or thousands of people suggesting that that product didn't work the way it did or the company didn't act the way it did, a critical component of that litigation is making sure that you're doing everything you can to, to defend the reputation of the brand. And the, the key to success in this case, in the defense work verdict, really was undermining the testimony of the CEO. And we pushed him out on a limb. And once we got to trial, we were very able to undermine his position and establish that he had no credibility. And once we established that he no, had no credibility, the other side's case fell apart. This case took three years to get from beginning to end, and that's a long time. And sometimes you think, when is it going to ever end? Where's the light at the end of the tunnel? Right, and it's essential to have trust, and, and the way you build that trust is through the depth of the relationship and, and keeping your client apprised of what's going on and making sure they have the faith in what you're doing and why you're doing it and how you're doing it. Another essential uh, issue here in terms of winning or losing, I think, was the expert discovery and what happened with the experts at trial. And, and they had a, a financial academic uh, uh, he had only been an academic, he hadn't done any trial work, and like Mike Tyson, the boxer, has, has said, everyone has a wonderful plan until you get punched right in the face. And this expert who's used to controlling his field in his classroom where students aren't asking him questions, as soon as he got to stand at trial and you went after him pretty hard and undermined his testimony, he completely collapsed. When something unexpected happens at trial, and you need to be ready to adapt quickly. And, and when you get punched in the face, you need to make sure that nobody thinks you got punched in the face and be smooth and react as if it was all expected all along. Winning or losing is often accomplished before you ever get to the courthouse steps. And you need to set up the arguments and the issues and the facts in a way that's gonna position yourself to succeed at trial. And three years of discovery and all kinds of fights about the experts and what they can say and what they can't say, I think illustrated that as well as any, that we had won the case by the time we started the trial.